Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Hayden and today I am reviewing my Titan Evo from 2022. Now I've had this chair for about two years and I realized I never did a review on it. So here we go. These are my thoughts on my Titan Evo 2022. Secret Lab Titan Evo. Comes in two different fabrics, leather and soft weave fabric plus I believe is what it's called. But it's actually not that bad. But I kind of wish I went with leather because I believe this thing is leather, which is what I'm used to feeling. Um, so it does feature magnetic pillow. The whole thing reclines. Magnetic covers for covering the little pieces on the side, like the bolts when you put the chair together. Um, it is adjustable up and down, you know, height. Every chair has that. Adjustable for your back. So there's knobs on the side that adjust the chair to your back, which is actually pretty cool. I don't feel like you see this on many other chairs these days. Magnetic wrist rests also. This is just a simple chair from Staples that was like $200. This is a $500 chair that has wrist rests that are magnetic underneath that stick. And there's a little lever on the middle side you have to press and they come off. That is in case you want to switch out your your little wrist rest for like, you know, a softer version, a bigger version, a smaller version. Pretty cool. And so far the chair, it's not that bad. It's been two years. I bought mine in 2022. Secret Lab tends to come out with chairs. It seems like every year because there's literally a weave, like a soft weave engraving on my chair that says 2022. So I guess the ones that come out yearly are you know like minor fixes from the previous version um, fun fact i believe the chair before mine 2021 version had the strap-on pillow and mine is magnetic i think the strap-on pillow would be kind of ugly so i got the magnetic one a year later and i've also been looking at these chairs for a really long time but i always couldn't justify the price tag because they come in at about 540 dollars to about 570 dollars now I don't really think many people can justify that price because that, when you think about it, is a lot of money for one office chair. So the features of this chair seems pretty good. Now one of the cons about this chair is they only have a website. You cannot use them or try them on in stores like Staples. Staples doesn't even have any of these. I've never been in to an Office Depot, so I really don't believe that they would have this kind of chair in there. But I will give it to Secret Lab for just having a website. They really do tell you the amount of features that this chair has. Like they say, ergonomic lumbar support system, complete recline and tilt adjustability, um, full metal armrest, which we talk about. They really give you the details about what this chair has. And since there are different sizes, they show you videos of the weight and height of the model sitting into the chair so you know which chair to buy for yourself. Now that is awesome. So my overall thoughts on this chair, it's not that bad, but steep price tag. And I feel like if I get rid of it now, after being used to it for two years now, I feel like I won't be able to go without it. Does that make sense? Because like I've used it for so long. If I get rid of it, I don't think I can get used to this chair again. And it's going to feel weird. It's not a bad chair, but only a website. You can't exactly fit it for yourself in person to see what it really feels like. And I think you're kind of taking a big risk when buying this chair. And I also forgot to mention that these, this company, Secret Lab, doesn't seem like their quality control is that great because even in the reviews on the site, people are saying, you know, mine's missing this, mine's missing that, I can't do this, I can't do that. And it seems like many people actually have to reach out to Secret Lab support. I know I did originally when I first got the chair. I don't remember what it was for though. But their support was actually really easy, email support, and they, um, I think they shipped me the part that I needed. I don't remember what it was for, but um, good support overall. So, all right, guys, that is my thoughts on the 2022 Titan Evo from Secret Lab. Um, if you like this video, please like it down below. Please leave in my comments what videos you'd like to see for 2025. Subscribe to the channel, and I will see you guys in the next video.